Hello, and welcome to this mini presentation, mini recital, mini concert of music for the holiday season. My name is George Shirley. I'm Emeritus Professor of Music, Voice, here at the University of Michigan. And I am more than delighted to be able to share some music with you for this season. My collaborator on this occasion is my good friend and colleague, Professor Martin Katz, who I had the pleasure of meeting a few years ago. At the beginning of my career, my manager set up a recital for me in California, and I didn't know any pianists in California. And I was asking around, and someone said, well, contact uh, Professor Gwendolyn Koldowski. Uh, she's a great teacher and pianist, and she may be able to, to join you in this performance. So I called her and she said, well, I know I can't, I'm not available to do it, but I have a student that I would highly recommend for you to consider. And she gave me the name of this young man, Martin Katz. And so I went, when I got out there, we met for a rehearsal, and little did I know at the time that I was performing with a young man who was going to go on and achieve such international fame as one of the greatest collaborative pianists in the world. And so it's my great pleasure to be able at this point to make music to share with you with Dr. Martin Katz and his 10 talented musicians. So we welcome you to this holiday presentation on behalf of the School of Music, Theater, and Dance. The opportunity to share some beautiful music with you, music that inspires us to live in peace and with compassion for one another. The first song, Agnus Dei, is a setting by the composer Georges Bizet. The translation of the setting, Agnus Dei, is Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Have mercy upon us.
Roland Hayes was the first African-American tenor to gain international fame as a concert artist and the first black singer of European classical music to be recorded by a major company, Columbia Records. Hayes was also a composer. And this next song, Sister Mary, composed in the form of a spiritual, is his musical lullaby to the Christ child. Sister Mary had a but one child born in Bethlehem and every time that a baby cried she'd rocked him in the weary land she'd rocked him in the weary land All three wise men to Jerusalem came they traveled very far they said where is he born a king of the Jews for we have seen his star King Herod's heart was troubled he marveled but his face was grim he said tell me where the child may be found I'll go and worship him I'll go and worship him. Sister Mary had but one child born in Bethlehem and every time that a baby cried she'd rocked in the weary land she'd rocked him in the weary appeared to Joseph and gave him a discommand. Arise ye, take your wife and child, go flee into Egypt land. For yonder comes old Herod, a wicked man and bold. He's slaying all the children six to eight days old, from six to eight days old. Sister Mary had but one child, born in Bethlehem, and every time that a baby cried, she'd rocked him in the weary land. She'd rocked him in the weary land. As a singer, and teacher, I've always looked forward to Christmas time because of the opportunity it presents to hear, sing, and teach some of the most rewarding and beautiful music produced by the human spirit. Now, I began singing the tenor solos in Handel's Messiah in the 11th grade in Detroit Northern High School's annual performance of this masterwork. In prior years, I loved singing Christmas carols in church and hearing this music on the radio. My biggest thrill as a professional singer was singing the bass solo, The Trumpet Shall Sound, at Lincoln Center with the Philadelphia Orchestra in 1964 when the bass fell ill at intermission. And Eugene Ormandy accepted my offer to add this wonderful solo to my repertoire. Excuse me, you have to understand, everyone, that George is a tenor. He doesn't have low notes like basses. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> True. I heard the solo often, so often in high school performances, but without the B section. Notwithstanding, I was confident 
that I could sing even though I had to sight read the B section. Our final offering today is a wonderful Christmas spiritual composed by another singer, composer, conductor, actor in films, TV, and on stage. His name is well known for his choral compositions, but possibly less so by singers and the general public today. He wrote music for films and solo singers. Jester Hairston is the composer's name, and my wonderful orchestra, Martin Katz and his 10 musicians, will perform a solo version of Hairston's beautiful choral setting of Rise Up, Shepherd, and Follow. There's a star in the east on Christmas morn. Rise up, shepherd, and follow. It will lead to the place where the Savior's born. Rise up, shepherd, and follow. Follow, follow. Rise up, shepherd, and follow. Follow the star of Bethlehem. Rise up, shepherd, and follow. Leave your sheep and leave your lambs. Rise up, shepherd, and follow. Take good heed to the angel's word. Rise up, shepherd, and follow. You forget your sheep. You forget your head. Rise up, shepherd, and follow. Follow, follow. Rise up, shepherd, and follow. Follow the star of Bethlehem. Rise up, shepherd, and follow. We thank you for joining us in this mini song fest. And my wonderful partner, Martin Katz, and I wish you and yours a meaningful, joyous, and peaceful, and loving, and compassionate, and empathetic holiday season. Happy holidays. <laughs>